Okay, we will introduce how to troubleshoot the bead breaking problems. So the main problem of the bead breaking is uh, air leaking. So when there is air leaking, it will cause the bead break bead breaking weak performance. So it's difficult to break the bead. So this is a uh, my bead breaking system. So this is a bead breaking valve, and this is the bead breaking cylinder. Okay, so this is my main power. The main power coming to this valve is like a switch. The valve is like a switch. So the main power, main air goes from this air fitting. Okay, and then the air will travel from this fitting to this fitting and then go to the cylinder and then the air will push the piston move to the left and then you can see the piston rod is is going out okay troubleshooting on the bead breaker cylinder so this is the the main part the main air the main air go from the middle fitting and then the air go from here to here and then travel to the end to the back side of the cylinder and the air will push the piston to the left and you can see now the valve rod is uh, stick out and the, the air from the the front will be pushed the piston will push the air out of the cylinder and uh, go from this feeding the air will go out here and to this feeding and then go through the go into the valve and release from this muffler the plastic muffler so that's the uh, the whole bead breaking airflow okay so if I press down this pedal and the air will go from now this this air pipe it, it will go instead this air pipe so the main air will go through this air pipe and go to the front of the cylinder and make the piston will push the air will push the piston to the right okay and then the valve the valve rod uh, the cylinder rod will go back and the air in the back will release out from this air pipe okay and to this air fitting and then go into the valve and release from this silence this muffler Okay, then how can we troubleshoot the cylinder? Okay, now uh, the air is in the back side of the cylinder. So the air, the main power, main, main air, go from this air pipe and now to this back side of the cylinder. And now I remove the front pipe. Okay, I remove the front pipe. And, and then if I if I notice that there is air leaking from this air fitting which means uh, this is a problem of the piston seal which means the air in the back side pass through the rubber seal and go into the front and leaking from this air fitting so this is a, then this will be the problem of the uh, rubber seal okay so in this case I have no air leaking from this air fitting so which means the rubber seal is uh, in good condition it stopped air in the back side the, the back the back side air cannot tr travel through this rubber seal okay for example if you have air leaking from this air pipe you okay the air leaking is not from this here but if from the air pipe then which means the air is leaking here now the air is going f through this uh, main air to this air pipe and now sh it should not go to this air pipe but if there is air leaking on this air pipe which we know that between this air fitting and this air fitting in, in between there is a rubber seal this rubber seal is got, got damaged so the air goes through the rubber seal and leaking out from this air pipe okay when you press down this uh, pedal and the air will 
go in direct the other direction. The air will go through this air pipe, go into the cylinder, and uh, the air will push this the piston go go inside. Okay, and the piston will push the air out of the the cylinder by this pipe, and then release from this valve from this muffler. Okay, so when the the piston uh, go to the end stroke, which means it cannot go go in further, then you can disconnect this uh, air pipe. And if you notice air leaking from this air fitting, then we know still problem of the piston rubber seal. But if but if there is air leaking from this air pipe, then we know that there is a problem between the seals of the seal between these two air fittings. Now the air should go in this way, not go in this way. But uh, if you, the air is, is leaking from this air pipe, then we know the seal inside is got damaged. So the air is, is leaking, the main air go through this air pipe and leaking out.